KS Heating and Air, the team ensuring your comfort. It's the Weather Extreme video. This is the morning edition. This is for Monday, the 29th of June. I'm James Spann. Good old summertime weather in place this week. Hot, humid, some sun, and scattered showers and storms. You know the story. Let's go to the upper air look at a cold trough back in the western states. Wouldn't be surprised if some snow would come down across some of the mountains out there, the high terrain. But around here, it's ridging. The radar is quiet early this morning. That was the composite at 452. A warm June morning. Temperatures are mostly in the 70s. Highs around 90 today. There's the watch warning map. Flash flood watches north of the state. Parts of Kentucky, Illinois, Missouri, Wisconsin, Minnesota. Heat advisories for parts of the Dakotas. And in the southwest, we have red flag warnings for wildfire danger. Here's the severe weather outlook today. Got three pockets with a marginal risk. No organized severe weather expected here. Tomorrow, a marginal risk clipping the Tennessee Valley of extreme North Alabama. And on day three, Wednesday, got a marginal risk for about the northern third of the state. And you know the deal. Some of the storms on uh, Wednesday might produce strong winds and small hail. But not like the severe weather threats we see in the spring or fall here. Here's the rain for the next seven days. The west is dry. Around here, rain amounts mostly between one and two inches between now and Monday morning of next week. The tropics, still lots of dry air across the Atlantic Basin. There is a tropical wave, a low-latitude wave coming across the Atlantic that is not expected to develop because of strong upper winds and the dry air. And also in the uh, five-day outlook, uh, the NHC guys have a little area off the east coast of the United States, kind of like the, the Dolly system. A surface low is expected to form out there if anything happens, not threatening land and most likely will not be a tropical storm. So model fans, let's go. Here's the GFS, the 06E run, 4 o'clock today. There's that big western trough. Little upper low is over New England. And for us, partly sunny, hot, humid, scattered Showers and storms, the pop-up variety this afternoon, this evening. Odds of any one spot getting wet, I'd say about one in three today. Highs around 90. That's going to be the theme for a while. Here's tomorrow and Wednesday. Highs stay close to 90, partially sunny with a few scattered storms about. Thursday and Friday, not a lot of change. The GFS looks a little drier on Friday. We'll see. Here's Saturday for the weekend, the 4th of July weekend. Come on now. This is Independence Day. Partly sunny with a few scattered afternoon storms. Of course, no way of knowing in advance exactly when and where they form. They'll just be around. Same thing on Sunday. This looks relatively dry. Afternoon highs will stay close to 90. And here's a week from today, Monday, the 6th of July. Little weakness to the east of here and a surface load near Jacksonville, Florida. And for us, that would suggest maybe a few isolated storms, otherwise partly sunny. Let's go out 10 days. This is Wednesday of next week, the 8th of July. Westerly's up north, and it's the same story. Partially sunny, hot, humid, the chance of an afternoon storm in spots. And we say that a lot this time of the year. Here's the uh, rain for Birmingham off the European Ensemble. The mean, about 3 inches over the next 15 days. Highs around 90, lows mostly low 70s. Very persistent look there through next week. And I like this, the CPC outlook, July 6th through the 12th, a little oasis here with potential for temperatures to be below average, and that's always welcome in summertime. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this morning. We'll have notes on the blog. The next video here by 4 o'clock this afternoon. You can catch us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10. Thanks for watching. Have a great day, and God bless. Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. 
Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no-interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call plumbing experts today.